we can't ignore technology at all because so much of introductions these days, at least first of people knowing who they are, is done online between Facebook and Twitter and Pinterest Absolutely. and stumbled upon and et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. So knowing how to navigate in a, a digital world is very important. Yeah, and knowing what not to do, I think oh, yeah. is even more important. So they want to know about how to flirt with a girl on Facebook. And I know from my my personal experience how not to do it. Uh, Give because, me an example of what not to do. Oh my gosh, there's there's these guys that you're not friends with mm -hmm. that will go through Facebook like it's an online dating site and oh, click yeah. on you and message you. And now you have to pay for it and they still do it. And they'll end up in the other box and they'll be like, you're pretty. Or, you know, you're hot, we should get together. Or something really lame that immediately that I don't even it. understand that they think that that's, that that's going to work. It like, doesn't work at all. I'm so glad site. this crazy stranger that I've never <laughs> met before is wants telling me, me that I have a great body and wants to meet me. I'm totally going to yeah, message him. Can't so wait. guys, first of all, don't be lurkers. Yeah. Don't be stalkers. Don't be liking every post, commenting on every post. Um, so this is if you're friends. Yes. So if you guys are already friends with a girl that you're interested in, absolutely do not like every post. And don't go back to the first picture that she ever posted on Facebook and like that because she's going to be like, what the hell was he doing going through all of my pictures on Facebook? Right. Which Creepy. I know we put them all out we there. We do. You but it's can like do you're it. meeting somebody for the first time. <laughs> you don't say, hey, what'd you do in third grade? Because <laughs> it's not applicable and it's a little bit too deep at that point. Um, so if you're already friends with someone, the main thing to do is just kind of look at their new stuff as they put up. Don't really go delve back and from it and just be um, conversational in yes. your posts. Don't like only the things that you like. Uh, if, you, if you want to send her a private message, um, just comment on something or suggest that they uh, maybe get together or do something, but don't come up with those lame, I think you're pretty, <laughs> I'd like to see you. Are you dating anyone? That sounds that's not like gonna they're going to put you in a cellar or somewhere. No, what, no. What, what, what if they're not already friends? What if they want, if they saw like a friend of a friend or something? Which is a great way to meet people. If you see that one of your friends has a really attractive friend posting on their mm -hmm. wall and you're like, hey, I would really be interested in getting to know them, message your friend. Be like, are they single? Your friend is now your virtual wing woman or wingman. Mm -hmm. And be like, I think insert name here is interesting, I would love to be introduced. And then your friend has the burden yep. of, hey, you two should really get together and you don't have to have all that pressure. And again, make sure that first message is like something along the lines of, uh, hey, you seem really interesting. I noticed that you're friends with Mike also, you know, just want to uh, send you a friend request. Just keep it light. I would actually say not to send a friend request no. because I'm not a fan of friending people on Facebook that you want to date because then they see way too much about your personal life. Interesting. It depends on the person, uh, but for a woman, I find that that gets a little messy on occasion because guys become territorial, they start posting on your wall, and then you have other people looking at your wall and they're like, some ah, might not be, how many people might, are you dating? Some people might not be ready to go immediately asking them for a date too. No, but you can wanna... message and talk. Mm -hmm. You could still talk back and forth. Or if you already friends, I know a lot of people are friends with people that they they want to, to flirt with. Right. And you can do the same thing. You can send them that message and start a conversation and talk about something that they posted because that's a conversation starter. And, and like she kind of mentioned too, don't use Facebook as match.com. Yeah. Don't use Facebook as OKCupid. Okay, no. It is a place for friends. Okay? Be friendly. Be friends. Online. And you yes. can say, hey, let's grab a drink in a mindset that we're just going as friends and see what happens because the chemistry online is always different than offline and you don't want to ruin this kind of connected circle that you have on Facebook because you're all in this together and you don't want it to get awkward. Yes, so be respectful, uh, be conversational. Be fun. Be fun, like us. High five. <laughs>